As you know, the Jason Bourne film series starring Matt Damon as the titular character is one of the most popular and influential action franchises of the 2000s. After a nine-year break between 2007's The Bourne Ultimatum and 2016 Jason Bourne, fans have been eager to see the next installment in the series. While nothing has been officially confirmed yet, there have been plenty of rumors and discussions about a potential sixth Bourne film, which would likely be called Jason Bourne 6. Story and Plot Speculation First up, let's talk about the potential story and plot for Jason Bourne 6. The ending of 2016, Jason Bourne left things pretty open-ended for the character. While he had regained many lost memories and took down the CIA Black Ops program Treadstone, Bourne was still on the run and in search for more answers about his past. The sixth film would likely pick up on this thread and show Bourne continuing his globe-trotting mission to uncover hidden truths. Perhaps he'll finally learn what happened to his father, Richard Webb, a mystery that has been teased since the Bourne identity in 2002 but never fully explained. Or maybe he'll dig deeper into the origins of Operation Treadstone and the other Black Op programs designed to create super soldiers through behavioral modification. The CIA characters from previous films like Nikki Parsons, Heather Lee, and Bob Dewey are all dead now, so Bourne would need to face off against new adversaries from the agency. One rumor suggests that Vincent Cassell would return as the ruthless asset character from Jason Bourne, which would provide some continuity with the last film. However the story goes, expect plenty of twists, turns, conspiracies, and shady government agendas for Bourne to uncover in the battle against the power that be. Based on comments from director Paul Greengrass, it also seems likely that Jason Bourne 6 would maintain a gritty, realistic, grounded tone like the previous films. Bourne's skills and determination are impressive, but the world he inhabits is dangerous and unforgiving. This tense atmosphere has defined the series since the Bourne identity, so we can expect that to remain for the future installments. Jason Bourne's Fighting Styles and Skills an important part of what makes Jason Bourne such an iconic action hero is his unique fighting style and impressive tactical skills. If a sixth movie happens, fans will be eager to see more of Bourne's signature combat and spycraft abilities. His fighting style mixes brutal efficiency with improvisation, using whatever weapons or objects happen to be within reach. Bourne demonstrates excellent hand-to-hand -hand combat technique combined with athletic power like parkour. His tactical and adaptive, constantly analyzing the terrain and adjusting his approach. Bourne also has extensive training in tradecraft technique like surveillance, hacking, infiltration, interrogation, and more. He can blend in and disappear into any environment, plan elaborate clandestine missions, and operate both independently or in coordination with allies. Jason Bourne's unique skill set makes him a one-of-a-kind action movie protagonist. Hopefully, Jason Bourne 6 gives fans more of this hard-hitting combat style and stealthy spy tactics if the project ends up coming to fruition. Potential Returning Characters and Cast Of course, Matt Damon would return as the title character, Jason Bourne, in the sixth film. Damon's intensity, charisma, and physicality have helped define the role over five films now. It's impossible to imagine anyone else stepping into Bourne at this point. Other returning supporting characters seem less certain, though. Julia Stiles' character, Nikki Parsons, helped Bourne throughout the original trilogy, but she was killed in Jason Bourne, which seemed to close the loop of her story arc. Joan Allen's CIA chief Pamela Landy was also killed in The Bourne Ultimatum, while David Strathairn's Noah Vosen hasn't appeared since that film either. Unless flashbacks are involved, it seems like we're going to get an entirely new supporting cast around Bourne in the sixth movie. That could provide opportunities for some interesting new talent to join the franchise. There have been rumors about Tommy Lee Jones or Ed Harris potentially joining as veteran CIA leaders who act as new antagonists for Bourne. We would also see some other big names take on a fresh government agent or operative roles to chase Bourne. While nothing is set yet, the return of Matt Damon is the only casting certainty for Jason Bourne 6 at this stage. Part of the excitement will be seeing which new faces end up populating the shady world of international espionage around him. Behind the Scenes Development Regarding behind the scenes development new for Jason Bourne 6, updates have trickled out over the past few years, but the future of the franchise still remains uncertain. In late 2016, shortly after the release of Jason Bourne, producer Frank Marshall confirmed that a sixth film was in development, with director Paul Greengrass and star Matt Damon attached. However, he cautioned that they were taking their time to find the right story before moving forward with the sequel. In early 2017, Greengrass reiterated this cautious approach, saying he first wanted to develop the perfect script that would justify a sixth installment before committing to the project fully. 
This underscores how selective and thoughtful the creative team aims to be when adding a new chapter to the beloved franchise. Sporadic updates have emerged since, including Universal Pictures registering a website domain for the film titled Jason Bourne 6 in the mid-2018. Damon and Greengrass have also indicated in occasional interviews that they remain interested in reuniting for another Bourne movie if the circumstances align properly. So, in summary, while Jason Bourne 6 appears to still be in early development, the creative team is also not rushing to make it happen and is still seeking the perfect concept to move forward. That means the future of the franchise is still very uncertain at this stage, with no defined timeline for when we might actually see another movie hit theaters. But the potential for a sixth installment is still there, if all the elements come together properly and the stars align for Damon, Greengrass, and Universal. Fan Theories and Speculations while we wait to see if an official sixth born film materializes, fans have plenty of theories and speculations about where the story could go next. One popular fan concept for Jason Bourne 6 is that Bourne could uncover some new information about his father, finally giving more background on his early life before Treadstone. Filling in Bourne's family history seems like a logical next step that many fans are interested in seeing explored in a sequel. After many hints throughout the original trilogy, learning more about Richard Webb and Bourne's origins could provide a fascinating new avenue for the story to delve into. Another direction a sixth Bourne film could take is having Bourne dig into the cancelled Treadstone successor programs like Outcome and Larks that were hinted at in the Bourne legacy. Exploring more of these covert projects could be a way to expand the Bourne universe even further. As Bourne continues unraveling more CIA secrets, exposing and confronting the shady successor program designed to create elite agents would make for compelling new conspiracies for him to uncover. Some fans also speculate that a prequel film showing a young Jason Bourne being recruited into Treadstone and going on his first mission as he's brainwashed into becoming an assassin could be interesting. It'd be a new territory for the series to take and to delve into his earliest days as a freshly minted agent. Seeing the initial origins of the Treadstone program and how Bourne was transformed into a highly skilled operative would provide a cool backstory that has only been hinted at so far. Additionally, many fans would love to see Bourne team up with Aaron Cross, the protagonist of The Bourne Legacy, played by Jeremy Renner, for a crossover story uniting the two covert agents against a shared enemy. Having Damien and Renner share the screen and join forces as Bourne and Cross would make an exhilarating combo that brings together the two phases of the Bourne franchise. While Julia Stiles, Nikki Parson is dead, another idea is that Bourne could track down her daughter in the sixth film and protect her from old foes that are threatening her due to Nikki's ties to Bourne. This would be a fitting way to keep Stiles' beloved character relevant even after her death, by having Bourne look after her orphan daughter. Those are just a few of the many fan theories out there about the directions Jason Bourne 6 could take. Part of the fun for Bourne devotees is speculating about where the iconic character might go next. That covers the major talking points about the potential next chapter in the Bourne saga. While we still have to wait for official updates from Damon, Greengrass, and Universal before learning Jason Bourne 6's actual fate, the signs point to it remaining a possibility that many fans hope does eventually come together. We'll be sure to keep you posted right here with any new details or announcements about progress on Jason Bourne 6 as we await word on the future of a hugely popular spy franchise. Do you think we're going to see Damon back in action as the iconic rogue agent? What storyline or characters would you want to explore in another Bourne sequel? Sound off with your thoughts in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to get all your movie reviews and breakdowns. Thanks for watching.